Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are gonna be unboxing the September BoxyCharm base box. So very, very excited for this one. It's a big one and it's my birthday month. So I'm feeling extra excited to open up some surprises. Before we get into it, please make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed. You don't wanna miss out on three videos a week. I do self tanner, makeup, all the best things. So please make sure to subscribe. But if you wanna see me unbox the September BoxyCharm box, stay tuned for the rest of the video. All right guys, so if you've been with me for a while, you already know the drill. I have no idea what's in here. I always just like to clarify that in the beginning of these videos, because if this is a newer kind of video to you, then you don't know. But I like to keep the boxes a surprise. I don't peek, I don't go on the website and check and see like what the choices are or anything like that. I always like to make sure that it's completely a surprise to me, because I feel like it's the most fun that way. And it's my birthday month, like I said, so I'll take all the little surprises I can get. This is like a little gift from me to me, so yay. Anyways, we're gonna get into unboxing this because like I said, this is a big one, so I'm very excited. I already ripped the little tab just so that I wouldn't take up time during the video doing it, but I have not peeked. I don't know anything. So basically, we're gonna open this up. As usual, it says, hello, Charmer. It has the Instagram handle and the hashtag too. And then when you open it up, it just says BoxyCharm in hot pink, which I love. So, okay. I already saw something that I'm extremely excited about, so let's just get into it. So, it just says Boxy Charm. This is the little card that tells you like what is in the box. So, I'm going to read the descriptions, give you the price, and then we'll talk about the product. So, the first one on the list is the one that I saw that I'm really really excited about. It is the Glam Glow Youth Mud Glow Stimulating and Exfoliating Treatment Mask. Youth Mud exfoliates with volcanic pumice rock to help smooth the appearance of fine lines and visibly soften skin's texture while natural clays lift impurities without disturbing skin's essential oils. Antioxidants from green tea smooth for more glowing, youthful looking skin instantly. And it goes for $60. Definitely not on the cheap side. This is a little pricey and I have tried this before. I used to have this and I love it. I already know this is a good product. So I'm extremely excited that I have this again. I'm gonna unbox it for you guys though, just so I can show you what it looks like on the inside. Every time I would put this on, my skin would literally feel so amazing afterwards. I, I can't even describe it to you. It's just like, your skin literally, it feels like brand new. Like it's so soft. It's like this like grayish color on the inside. So let me see if I can take this off for you guys. Yeah, I'm gonna save this though because there's some product on there. But here's what it looks like inside. It smells super, super good. I would prefer if it didn't have a smell, but it's fine. It doesn't really bother me. And the product itself is really good. So the smell is very much worth it. It feels really like it's soft, but when you rub it on your skin, it has these little flakes in it, so it is like a little bit rougher on your skin. It does exfoliate for sure. And then you keep it on for a while and then you wash it off. But it works so well, you guys, and I think this is 100% worth it. So I already know that I love this and I already know it's gonna be good. So that one's already a big yes. <laughs> Next on the list is from Half Caked, which I have not heard of. It's the Best Friends Forever In Bloom Plus Duo Fiber Brush Set. It says, meet your blush BFFs. Get intense pigment with a matte finish that will take you from day to night. Apply to the apples of your cheeks or tops of your cheekbones with this 100% synthetic brush, custom created to give an airbrushed finish. Developed with sensitive skin in mind, the fragrance-free formula gives you the perfect flush every time, and it's $22. Oh, this is big too. Okay, let's see what is in here. So this comes bubble wrapped, so it's a blush and a brush set. So let's look at the blush first. Oh, this is a pretty color. This is like my kind of blush color. It feels really soft when you touch it and it's 
super, super pigmented. Look at that. I was not expecting that. So a little definitely goes a long way with this. And then the brush, I've actually been needing a new blush brush. This I really like. It feels super soft, but it's not like too soft, you know? And it's not crazy dense either. Let's just like test it out a little bit though and see what we're working with. I'm gonna be gentle with it. Wow. A little definitely, definitely goes a long way, but it's such a pretty color. Okay, even just tapping the slightest, slightest bit, you gotta be careful. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Whoa. The color though is really, really pretty. It's not patchy at all either. It comes off really evenly and smoothly. And I like how this blush applied it. It just like melted into the rest of the products that I had on. So, so far I do really, really like this. Next we have from Georgette Klinger, the Marula Primer. It is, or it says, Blur imperfections and ensure an all-day radiant finish. Hydrating and long-wearing, it cushions skin with advanced hyaluronic acid, ensuring silky smooth makeup application that won't settle into pores, fine lines, or dry areas. A nourishing blend of marula oil and vitamins A, E, F, and B locks in moisture and protects against visible signs of aging. Ideal for all oil and silicone-based foundation formulas. And it's $32. I really like this packaging. Like just seeing it just like this makes me feel like it's really like luxe and expensive looking. So I do really, really like the packaging. I am such a sucker for rose gold, you guys. Like anything rose gold, I'm like, I love this. So of course I'm gonna like this. And then on here it just says the same thing, all skin types, 1.7 ounces. So again, pretty big. And then just opening this up to test it out. Obviously, I'm not going to put it on my face because I have makeup on already, but I will put some on the back of my hand just to see how it feels, if there's a smell, all that fun stuff. So there's not really a smell. I already love that right off the bat. Let's see how it feels on the back of my hand. Oh my god, okay. Be careful when you're squeezing it because the product comes out super easily. I put way too much on right there. Let me see if I can just scoop some back out. I don't want to waste the product. So I have like that much on the back of my hand. I really, really like how that feels. It's super lightweight. Doesn't dry down like too crazy quickly, but it does dry down fairly quickly. It's not sticky. It just feels really nice. It made like this area of the back of my hand feel really good. Again, no smell. I don't really have much else to say about it for now though. This is like one of those products that I have to test out for a while before I can give any kind of opinion on it because it goes under makeup. So, but right now seeing what I'm seeing and like hearing what I'm hearing, it sounds really, really good. So I'm gonna have to do this when I do my makeup the next time and see what it does for me. So, so far I'm a fan. Next up is Pinky Rose Cosmetics, which is also new to me. It is the multi-use makeup base sticks, a cream base multi-use makeup stick that can be used on the eyelids as an eyeshadow or a primer to your eyeshadow. Can also be used on the bottom lash line, waterline, brow bone, or lips. The perfect duo to be used together or separately, and it's $20. So here this is. I don't know if I'm a fan of this. We'll see. Let's see what it looks like on the inside. Like this outer box, I don't know, but... Okay, so it's two sticks. Let's open these up. So this one is a cream one. Doesn't have like a name. Oh yeah, it does. This is hip hop. So let me do a little swatch of this. Yeah, okay, so this would be like the primer one. It's just like a nude color and it's matte. So you could use this as like a eyeshadow primer. You could do like under your brow bone to clean them up. It feels really good. It has like a slight tackiness to it, which I really like for this kind of product. It blends out really, really nicely. Let's see this other one. This is called Jazz and this is like a goldy bronze kind of color. And I think it's kind of sparkly. Yeah, this is beautiful. Holy crap. 
Look at this. Wow, wow, wow. This also blends out pretty dang nicely. Feels super soft and smooth. The color is beautiful. All right, I'm gonna have to keep playing around with these. This outer packaging like threw me off a little bit, but I love like cream eyeshadows in a stick form. I feel like it's so travel friendly. It's so easy to use. And if they're like this, it's really good because they're really creamy and blendable. So I am definitely going to be playing around with these more. They're just, they seem really, really convenient. So I like them so far. And then last on our list, number five, we have from Give Them Lala Beauty, which was new to me, but I believe I got one of these products in my last BoxyCharm or the one before that. And it is the mascara. It says, Give Them Lala Beauty Mascara creates fuller, more dramatic looking lashes. The silicone brush separates, elongates, and plumps, giving you the perfect glam without clumping, flaking, or smudging. And it's $20. So that description just sounds like my ideal mascara. Like I don't want something clumpy or just fake looking. Like I want something to look really natural, but still give me a lot of drama, if that makes sense. I really like this packaging. It's super simple. I feel like they could have added a little more something on this part of the tube. There's really only any detail at the top part of it. So that, eh, I don't know. Let's see what the product itself is. Um, I personally usually like when the bristles are a little bit bigger than this. Like these bristles seem small and short and that kind of does tend to clump up for me so I don't really know. I already have some mascara on but let's just do a little application and see what this does. I'll be honest, just putting it on like that, I feel like it didn't really make too big of a difference from what they already were. But I also don't want to judge it too hard because I already had a layer of a different mascara on. So I can't give you guys like a true, true review of what I think about this. But just from applying it to another mascara, I feel like it didn't really do anything too crazy for me. I don't feel like it really like elongated them. I also don't think it made them clumpy though. So that is a good thing. I hate when my lashes get clumpy, especially when you're putting on just like a second layer. So, so far, not too bad. This is definitely something I have to keep trying out though and seeing what it's gonna do for me. But that is all five products. That's all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I definitely feel like this was a really good box. I feel like there were a lot of, well, it was a majority of brands that I haven't heard of before and all the products ended up being really nice, at least for now. So I'm really, really excited to test them out, get to know these new brands. That's like my favorite part of BoxyCharm. And I'm so excited to use this Glam Glow mask again. You better believe I'm doing it like right after I stop filming because it feels really good and it just makes my skin look so nice. So very excited about all of these products. Like I said though, that's it. Make sure to comment. Let me know what you guys think about these products. Give me your thoughts and opinions on what you think of my box. Let me know if we got the same box or if you got something different in yours. Just say hello, give me your thoughts. Give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, please, 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 if you haven't already. But stay tuned and I will see you guys in the next video.